believe it or not, there was a city here at one time, a mining town, that had something like 10,000 people here, and there isn't a trace of anything left. And uh, one of the buildings that uh, was uh, prominent here burned down a couple of years ago, and it's so sad because it's such a beautiful uh, natural stone building. It, uh, it just broke my heart when that thing broke, burned down. Anyway, I'm on my way to Bozeman. Um, just got done having lunch with uh, and spending some time with uh, John DeMont and Todd uh, uh, Connor, and uh, we uh, he was showing uh, some tricks about painting to uh, Todd. Todd is a graduate of uh, a big art school down in California, the Art Institute, or I think that's what it is. Uh, John DeMont. Uh, is just an amazing painter. Um, he demands uh, all five figures for his paintings uh, because he's that good. And uh, anyway, it was just a real treat to stand there and watch him talk about uh, clouds and how to blend them and stroke them and all that stuff and working on foregrounds and bringing your attention back to uh, the figures on the ground if it's a landscape. Uh, just really fascinating and uh, then we went to lunch and uh, a friend of mine was there he's a taxidermist looks like a French trapper I mean that's what his face and hair looks like and so we're gonna set up a model session with him uh, sometime in the near future but anyway it was just really good um, had my hard drive go out on me last night my ex my external hard drive my backup and it's still out, and I have no idea how to get it working again. Uh, I did have a backup from about five years ago, and a, and a key thing about it was it had all the stuff I need in my art folder, which uh, I lost on the uh, current uh, hard drive. I, ha I did have an epiphany a couple of months ago, and I thought, what would I do if I lost these particular folders because of a crash of an external hard drive. So what I did was I uh, had downloaded those folders onto my PC's hard drive a couple months ago and it, I'll tell you it was a good thing because I could have never recovered those on my current hard drive uh, because uh, that many years ago I was not um, well I was not doing uh, my instru instructional DVDs and all the, the layouts and the printed material was on that hard drive or that backup drive but I did save them on my PC's hard drive Anyway, um, going to Bozeman, I get, have a gentleman in Italy who bought uh, about six of my DVDs, my instructional DVDs, and uh, he's uh, sent me some money uh, through a MoneyGram, and I'm going to pick that up and then get his order out to him. So, all of you outside the country who are considering buying my DVDs, uh, you can. And uh, if you got a PayPal account, it's easier. But if you don't have a PayPal, you can always work around it and get you your DVDs. All right, uh, I'm going to reshoot the first part of my, or the second part of my review of Clay that I did yesterday that I lost on that hard drive. And uh, get that out tomorrow. Um, hopefully tomorrow night. Well, I'm done with Bozeman and uh, just stopped by to see how uh, Todd's painting's coming along. And just stand in the shade up there, which is so nice. Oh my. He's got a great, great place for a studio. I would... Anyway, the mountains still have snow on them. It's, uh, let's see what temperature it is. 
80 degrees outside. That's the highest it's, I think it's the highest it's been since the beginning of the year. Those are the, uh, that's a lone mountain behind uh, that uh, big fan mountain. And like I said, I used to live right at the base of that mountain. All right, I'm tired. I'm teared. I'm going home and go to bed. Wait up.